All right, so we have our own like little National Geographic documentary, and Colton's going to uh, see if his uh, dog Axel will pull a sled. And he's a work dog, hunting dog. Uh, so we're gonna see if he can pull some firewood. See how that goes. What do you see here? A boy and a dog? Axel. Look a little closer. You might see a bond that's growing. Companionship and friendship that will last a lifetime. Oh, and that's me. You got to make him stop doing that. Yes, the boy needs to show that he is one that can be trusted by his dog and one that his dog can follow. Good job, what? Hey, come on. <laughs> He's ready to go. Come this way. Come this way. There you go. Oh, now you're tangled. Alright, come on. Come on. See, he's he's too little to pull you. You need to He's doing pretty good, but get some firewood and put it in there and then just walk beside him and have him follow you pulling it. Look at the progress. He's doing great. I'm gonna quit narrating now because I am terrible at it. Hey! Roscoe! Roscoe! You can't make sharp turns like that. Walk big circles. All right, you need to put Roscoe up. Put him in a sled. <laughs> Before I go, I would like to mention that it was a bad idea to put Roscoe in the sled. One more thing, here you see the dog leading the boy, which is actually opposite of what was supposed to happen. Good job, buddy. Good job. You're just distracting the other one. All right, you come here. To make him follow you. Hold the leash right at his neck. Pull him through. <laughs> you can't let him do that. Hey, Axel. Axel, no. You have to grab him up here and show him to follow you. Come. He doesn't want to go anywhere without. Prospects. Now he is able to. Come. No, beside him. Come. Beside him come and on. go. Come on. Hey. Come. Axel, come on. Come on. All right, go to the field. Come this way. Yeah. It's a good one, it? You'd be a good work dog, good hunting dog. Train him to listen. Oh, you told him to go. Can't climb a hill with a sled. Come on. Come this way. Come on. 
Axel, Axel, Axel. Come on. All right, man, go that way. Run that way. No, you can't leave him tangled with a rope. There you go. All right, so he's doing pretty good with the sled. He's pulling it good. Maybe 20 pounds. Looks like he'll be good carrying a pack camping or something. Axel, here. Axel, here. Here. Good job. Hold, hold, sit. Sit. Stay. Stay. Hey, don't chew the rope. Go, hey. Alright, go. Go, go. Good job. What? Hey, I said walk. All right, walk out in the field. He's following you. Go to the field. Go to the right so he follows you away from the tree. Go out to the field. You got to pay attention to the sled and watch out where he is in relation to it all the time. Keep going, keep going, keep going. All right, you can stop. Tell him. Good job. Good job, Axel. Tell him stay. Stay. Sit. Sit. We sit. sit. Probably won't sit in the snow at the moment. All right, give him a treat. Hey, I'm gonna lose that day. Hold him out. Good job. Yeah. All right, hold it. Let him eat it. Here Good I job. Am. All right. Hit it already. No. Alright, just walk. No. Walk around in a circle. Remember I said walk. Make sure you follow. Alright, come on this way. Get him to come to you. Put him in there and let him rest. Yeah, I yeah, gotta get a bigger harness. Yeah. Easy though. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, Easy. Alright, pull right there. It's the most snow this truck's ever seen. Alright, so we can't have a dog lying around not working. Right? So we got a job for him. 
Alright, so we're going to get him to move this Christmas tree to the brush pile. Hopefully it'll come off. Take him to the brush pile. Come on. Hey. Rascal, Back. come on. That might be too heavy for you. Alright, come on. That didn't work too well. That's, that tree's too heavy for him. Too cut, big a load. You cut it in half. <laughs> Harness works better. You got to hang on back. You must go back in where it's warm. We got you're strong. Yeah, put them on there. Put them on top. Look at all of them. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, what?